Super Blaze, we need to speed up and catch that musician's guitar. Help me accelerate to a speed of nine. Count to nine with me. One, One two, two, three, three four, four, five, six, six seven, seven, eight, nine! I think this belongs to you. My guitar! Groovy! Look! The trouble robot's right over there! He's headed for Crusher and Pickle! Wow, Crusher! Did you make that cake for us? I sure did, Pickle! It's a perfect cake for a perfect day! The kind of day where nothing else can go wrong! Except the cake getting tossed away by a giant robot! To catch that cake, we've got to accelerate to a speed of ten! Count to ten with me! One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten! I got it! My cake! Yay! Thank you, Super Blaze! Trouble. Trouble. Now let's take care of this last trouble robot once and for all! Trouble, trouble, trouble. These robots will never make trouble in Axis City again. Trouble, 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 trouble. 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 Someone's coming to help them! It's the lifeguards! Lifeguards are amazing! Yeah. But look, there's one more kitty cat! And that wave is headed right for her! Hang on, kitty! We're coming! Mission Blaze! What? Oh, he's not giving up! Launching more butt balls! <laughs> Help me use my water blaster to destroy those mud balls. When you see a mud ball coming, say mud ball. Let's keep looking. When you see another mud ball, say mud ball. Mud ball! Oh, yeah! All right! We're almost at the top! When you see that last mud ball coming, shout mud ball! We 
turned me into a hang gliding monster machine! Moo! Moo moo! Moo! Awesome! Now hang on, we're gonna ride some air currents. Oh yeah! Nice hang gliding, Blaze! Caps, those aren't warm air currents. Those are cold air currents. Uh-oh. The cold air is pushing our hang glider down. Now we're flying too low to make it to the other side. Help me look for warm air that can lift our hang glider up higher. When you see a current of warm red air, say, warm air. lifted us higher. But we need to go even higher to get the baby cow back to her family. When you see a current of warm air, say, warm air. Warm air! Going up! We're almost there, little cow. We just need to get a little higher. When you see a current of warm air, say, warm air. Warm air! Yeah! Look, we made it! Little cow? Moo! Moo! <gasps> it's Starless Ranch! And there's the barn! Yeah! Here we are! Ooh. Oh, yeah! I'm a water cannon monster machine! All right! Hey. Come on! Let's blast some ice! <laughs> Ice go! Boom! Quick, let's keep moving and catch those dinosaurs. Blades, look out! More ice! There are three ice chunks straight ahead. And one more just came up. How many ice chunks are there all together? Four, right. Help me blast them all. Count to four with me. One, two, three, four! Watch out, Lays! Two ice chunks straight ahead! And three more just popped up. How many ice chunks are there all together? Five! Yeah! Let's blast them! Count to five with me. One, two, three, four, five! Yeah! Look, we've almost caught up to the dinosaurs! Careful! That four ice chunks! And three more! How many are there all together? Seven! Let's blast them! Count to seven with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven! Whoa! We did it! Hang on, dinosaurs! Zag, get you down! Zag! Where did that thing come from? Look out! Another one! Yeah! Gaskets! This place is full of horrible hider bots! They're really good at hiding! How are we gonna get past them? Don't 
Don't worry, AJ. Nothing can hide from a shark. Check it out. Whenever an animal moves in the water, they make tiny waves called vibrations. And sharks have super special sensors on their body that can feel those vibrations. So even if we can't see a Hyderbot, we can still figure out where it's hiding by feeling the vibrations. Come on, let's use our sensors to help us get past those horrible Hyderbots. Hang on, I'm feeling a vibration. That means there must be a Hyderbot hiding somewhere right nearby. Let's look for him. Where's the Hyderbot hiding? Right there! <laughs> Not so fast, horrible Hyderbot. Oh, right! We trapped him! That Hyderbot can't get us now. Oh! <gasps> Another vibration! Where's the Hyderbot hiding? Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> we got another one! All right! There's just one horrible Hyderbot left. And he's got to be out there somewhere. Oh, I feel the vibrations. Where's the Hyderbot hiding? Yeah, right there! <laughs> No more hider bots! Nothing stop, Shark, please! Now come on! We've gotta hurry and get that crown before Crusher! Shark, shark Power! and a basketball. Which one's sticky? Tape or a basketball? The tape, right! Yeah! It worked! One of the blaster jets got stuck to the tape. There are still more blaster jets chasing us! Quick! Let's find something else that's sticky! Let's see. I've got a paper clip and maple syrup. Which one's sticky? A paper clip or maple syrup? Maple syrup! Yeah! Time for some adhesion! There's only one blaster jet left! Whoa! To stop this last blaster jet, we could use glue or water. Which one's sticky? Glue or water? Keep looking for more sharks. If you see another shark, say shark. Shark! <laughs> Not today, shark. Yeah! Oh, chomp chomp. All right. To get to the pirate, we just have to get past one more shark. If you see a shark, say shark. Shark! Boy, am I glad to see you! Me 
ship is going down! I see the problem, pirate. There's a hole in your ship. A hole? And look! The missing piece is way over there. Yar! But me ship's almost sunk! Then we'd better get that piece super fast. Time for blazing speed! To give us blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! Like a rainbow. And look at those clouds up ahead. They're starting to rain. When the water drops in a cloud come together, they make even bigger drops. Drops that are so heavy, they fall out of the cloud as rain. Whoa! All that rain is making the track super slippery. To catch up with the rotor, we've got to help Blaze steer around the puddles. Come on! Look for the color that doesn't have any puddles on it. Which color should we drive on? Red! Yeah! There are no puddles on red. Steer that way! Nice driving! <laughs> Get ready! More puddles up ahead! To keep away from the puddles, which color should we drive on? Green! All right! Yeah! Now which color should we drive on? Orange! Yeah! What color should we drive on now? Blue! Woo -hoo -hoo! Yeah! Nice work helping me get past all those slippery puddles. <gasps> do you hear that, Blaze? I sure do. It sounds like the rotor. Come on, we gotta hurry. Swoops is counting on us. Race cars, rev it on! A sharp monster machine! Woohoo! Oh, that is cool! All right! Hang on, animals. AJ and I are gonna get that crown back. Shark, shark power! Go get him, shark, please! The starting line is this way. Uh-oh, that didn't sound good. Gaskets, those are storm clouds. Watch out, please. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Gotta find some way out of this storm.
platform or we'll never get to the Super Sky Race. Look, down there! We can fly through that hole in the storm clouds. But we've got to hurry. It keeps getting smaller. You can make it, Blaze! Yeah, you're a falcon now. The fastest animal in the whole world. Falcons fly their fastest when they dive down. With their aerodynamic shape, they can dive at speeds of up to 100 meters per second. Here I go! Let's see how fast we're going. What number is that? 40. That's fast, but not fast enough. We've got to get to 100 meters per second. Try to speed up, please. woo now we're going this speed. What number is this? 70. That's really fast, but we're still not at 100. Uh-oh, look! That hole in the storm is almost closed. I've got to go faster. Now what number is it? 100. That's it! <laughs> Let's hurry and get to that race. Falcon, fly! A sky surfer! <laughs> now, to get out of this hole, we've got to fly our sky surfer all the way up there. Yeah, we need to fly to a height of 100. Count by tens with us to 100. Repeat after me. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100! Our Sky Surfer made it! And look, there's the flying contest! But the contest is about to start! Well, then we'd better fly our Sky Surfer super fast! <laughs> to give us blazing speed, say, Let's blaze! Let's blaze! Gentle trucks, let the flying contest begin! <laughs> now those are some high flyers! <laughs> Watch this! <laughs> oh my! Rusher's machine is flying even higher! I'm gonna win! But wait! Here comes one last flying machine! Oh no! It can't be! It's AJ and his Sky Surfer! The highest flyer of them all! <laughs> and that is one awesome flying machine! Machine Sky Sprayer! Wow, Blaze! I've never seen a machine like this! Going up! Sky Sprayer Blast! Yeah. Uh-oh! The water's not hitting those flowers! Come on! Help us aim the hose! To hit these flowers, should we spray higher or lower? Yeah! All right! We're watering them! And now the flowers are blooming! Come on, let's water some more! Sky sprayer, blast! To hit the flowers, should we spray higher or lower? Lower! Yes! Yeah! They're blooming! Just one more, Blaze! 
best flowers dead ahead. Sky sprayer, left! To water these last flowers, should we spray to the left or to the right? To the right! Woohoo! We did it! We watered all the flowers! Hang on, AJ! We're going down! Yeah! <laughs> oh, boy! Gator Lagoon, you say? Curious why they'd call it that. <laughs> Whoa, that's a lot of gators. How are we gonna get across the lagoon? Hey, I have an idea. Let's launch ourselves over the gators and onto those ships with a cannon. Yeah, all right. Cannons launch things using combustion. When you put heat, fuel, and oxygen together in a cannon, boom! There's a powerful explosion that can launch us into the air. Let's launch ourselves over the gators to that first sunken ship. Over there. Switching to visor view. With a little blast of combustion, the cannon will launch us here. And with a big blast, it'll launch us here. To get to the ship, should we do a little blast? or a big blast. A big blast, yeah! A little blast won't send us far enough. Get ready for a big blast of... Combustion! Combustion! <laughs> All right! We made it! <laughs> and here comes the big wheel! Ha <laughs> Let's do that again! Come on, let's use this cannon to launch us to that next ship over there. With a little blast of combustion, we'll land here. And with a big blast of combustion, we'll land here. To get to the ship, should we do a little blast or a big blast? A little blast, right! Time for a little blast of... Combustion! combustion! Oh! Yeah! Whoa! It sure is a long way down. Hmm. I've got to find some way to get across without falling into the water. Hey, check it out! Slippery slides! I bet if I slide down the right one, it can launch me to the next rock over there. Come on! Let's do an investigation. We're gonna figure out which slide I should take. Here, I'll roll a coconut down each slide, and you look carefully to see where they land. Ready? Look carefully. Which coconut made it to the rock? The green coconut, yeah! This slide launched it all the way over. The yellow coconut splashed down into the water, so we definitely don't want to go that way. Here I go! Yahoo! <laughs> All right, we made it! Let's do a new investigation. We've got to figure out which slide can get us to that rock over there. Hmm, which slide do you think will get us there? Well, let's use these coconuts and find out. Which coconut made it to the other side? The yellow one! It went down this slide. Come on, let's go the same way. Whee! Yeah! Phew, just one more jump to go. Which slide do you think will get us there? Well, let's find out. Which coconut made it to the other side? The green coconut. And it went down this slide. Yahoo! Yes! We made it all the way across! Let's We're 
We're catching up! Caskets! We'd better grab the jungle horn before it goes down that waterfall! I missed! Let me try! Aw, lug nuts! Oh no! It's almost at the falls! I can almost reach! Here, Stripes! Hang on to me! Ha! I got it! Oh! oh no! We're too heavy! It's making the log unbalanced! To balance, we need something on the other side that weighs the same as me and Stripes! <gasps> the jungle horn! I can use it to call my animal friends! They can help us balance! Blazing Stripes! All right! It worked, Stripes! Your animal friends balanced the law! Yeah! Thanks, animals! Blood nuts! Someone's blasting cannonballs at us! Cannonballs? It must be... Pirates! <laughs> Keep blasting! Everywhere. And they really want to sink our ship! Hey, I've got an idea. To stop those pirates and their cannons, let's build a cannon of our own. Ooh, cannon? Zag like! I'm a cannon monster machine! Wow! Zag's cannon! Quick, y'all! Let's load the cannon with cannonballs! The cannonballs should be right in here! Uh-huh. Those are not cannonballs. Those underpants. Underpants? Don't worry, crew. Underpants are even better than cannonballs. Come on, let's blast those pirates with underpants. Aye, aye, Captain Blaze. <laughs> we got them now, crew. Switching to visor view. Show us the trajectory. If I aim the cannon low, the underpants will land here. Will they hit the pirate's boat? No! <laughs> Whoa! Quick, Blaze, aim higher! If I aim high, the underpants will land here. Now will they hit the boat? Yes! Yo-ho! Underpants! Pirate! <laughs> to get the cotton candy machine, I've got to pull harder than that pirate bighorn. I need more force! Yeah! Force is a push or a pull. Big rigs have super powerful engines. That way, even when you fill the trailers with big, heavy things, they've got enough force to pull it off! Now, Big Rig Blaze is pulling with a force of one, and the Pirate Bighorn is pulling with a force of three. Which number is bigger, one or three? Three, yeah! That means the Pirate Bighorn's pulling with more force. <laughs> Quick, we've got to help Big Rig Blaze pull harder. Increasing force. It's working! Now Blaze is pulling with the force of six. Which number is bigger, six or three? 
Six, rock! Yeah! Now Blaze has more force! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Uh-oh. Now the pirate Bighorn is pulling as hard as he can. He's pulling with a force of eight. Which number is bigger, six or eight? Now the Bighorn has more force. <laughs> I can't let him get the cotton candy machine. Increasing force! That's it, Blaze. Now you're pulling with the force of 12. Which number is bigger, 12 or 8? 12! Yeah! Nobody has more force than... Big Red Blaze! <laughs> we got the cotton candy machine! Phew! I don't see the shark bot anymore. Maybe we lost him. Yeah! Or maybe not. That shark bot's a big problem, Blaze. And we need to find a solution. Hmm. We've got to find some way to make him stop chomping. And the only way to do that is to feed him something he can't chomp. Whoa! I've got a big piece of rope. Great! Let's do a test and see if the shark bot can chop through rope. Did he break the rope? Yeah, and it only took him one bite! Hey, how about a stick? This seems pretty strong. Sure, let's test it and see if the shark bot can chop through a stick. He's chopping the stick! Did he break it? He did! Yeah, but it wasn't as easy for him that time. It took the shark bot three bites to break it. Quick, AJ, see if you can find something even harder to bite. Ooh, look! A metal pipe! This feels like the hardest thing yet! Let's test it! Did he break the metal pipe? No! He can't bite through! Look! He's falling apart! Look out! Oh, uh -oh. Hold on, Sparky! Sparky! Ah. Tiger claws! Sparky! Sparky, Sparky! Don't worry, Sparky! I've got you! Oh no! Stripes and Sparky are in trouble! Lugnuts! This dam is breaking and water is pouring through those cracks! Oh, oh, oh. This calls for structural engineering. We need to fix those cracks and make the dam strong again. Ooh, I know what we can use. A concrete pump truck. It can pump concrete into the cracks to fill them up and stop the leaks. Great idea. Let's turn me into a concrete pump truck. I'm a concrete pump monster machine. Water's getting higher! Sparks, Sparky! Hang on, Stripes! We're gonna fix that dam! <laughs> Extending the boom arm! Turning on the pump! Time to blast some concrete! It's working, Blaze! The concrete is hardening and fixing the crack! Gaskets, we've got to hurry and fill the rest of these cracks or the whole dam will fall apart. I know. Let's use blazing speed and fix this dam super fast. To give me blazing speed, say, let's blaze. Let's, let's blaze. blaze. Yeah. Yeah. The dam is fixed! And look, the water's going 
down. Woohoo! We're saved, Sparky. Sparks Mark. <laughs> Nice work, Gabby! Yeah! Now we can sail back to Axel City! <laughs> Guess what, Slowpokes? I fixed my sailboat first! Uh, Crusher, your boat doesn't look very fixed. And that's not a sail, it's a pair of pants! Ah! My sailboat is the best boat! It's number one! Except for the fact that it's sinking! Sinking? <laughs> Quick, we've got to help them. Aye, aye, Captain Blaze. Here, grab onto these. Hooray! Blaze saved us. Oh, Blaze, you're my hero. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. You're welcome, Pickle. Now let's set sail for Axel City. We're going home! Well, at least I can finally relax. Yep, from here on out, it's smooth sailing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah! I'm a speedboat monster machine! Whoa! Get ready to go, team. I'm increasing the propeller's rotational speed to 50. <laughs> Look, here comes a fountain. Those fountains are gonna keep flooding the racetrack unless someone turns them off. I can do it. All I need are my water skis. Yeah! Woohoo! Go, Gabby! Okay, Fountain, time to turn you off! She shut off that fountain! All right! Now come on, let's turn off the rest of these fountains. Whenever you see a fountain, say, Fountain! Now keep looking. When you see the next fountain, say fountain. Fountain! Yeah! Only one more to go. When you see the last fountain, say fountain. Turned off all the fountains. And look, the water is going down. All right. Those look like chopping shark flowers. Oh man, they're everywhere, Blaze. They're growing out of the floor and the ceiling. The only way we're gonna get past those shark flowers is to steer past them. And we can do it with the power of floating. Yeah. Remember. Things float when they have enough air inside them. And a submarine has a special part that can fill with air. A ballast tank! Yeah! When air goes into the ballast tank, it pushes the water out, and we float higher. Then, if we want to sink lower, we push the air out again and let the water come back in. Let's use floating and sinking to steer past those shark flowers. How shall we steer to get past them? Shall we go over or under them? Over, yeah! Adding air to our ballast tank! Ah. Yeah. We got past them! More shark flowers! To get past them, shall we go over or under them? Under! 
getting rid of air to sink under. Shark flowers! Should we go over or under them? End of the tunnel. But to make it, we'll have to get past those last shark flowers. Should we go over or under them? Under! <laughs> See you later, shark flowers. Oh, it's breaking! <laughs> oh no, they're floating away. Come on, tow truck team. We've got to help them. Look, there's the baby panda. Quick, let's use our tow truck to grab him. Yeah. Nice one, Blaze. Now we just have to pull him in. My winch isn't turning. The water's pulling on the panda with too much force. What we need to make it turn? We need torque. Yeah, torque is turning strength. And the more turning strength our tow truck has, the harder it can pull. Come on, let's give our tow truck more torque. To rescue that panda, we need to increase our torque to five. Count to five with us. One, two, three, four, five. Welcome, little guy. Now let's go rescue the other pandas. This way, baby panda. Look, there's the mommy panda. Got her. All right, Blaze, reel her in. To pull this panda in, we need to increase our torque to seven. Count to seven with us. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven! Ah! <laughs> oh, yeah! There's the little bunny! You're here! I knew you'd make it! I knew it, and then I kept knowing him, and then I knew it again, and then again! Little bunny, watch out! Longer. Then we need to get to her super fast. We need blazing speed. To give us blazing speed, say, let's blaze. Let's blaze. I'm slipping. <laughs> Got you, little bunny. Now hang on. You did it, Blaze. Yeah. You're safe now, little bunny. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Come on, Pickle. We need to get our sail back up like those guys. Aye, aye, Crusher. <laughs> I'm not a sail. Get me down from here! Consider it done. Uh-oh, Crusher. I think you're losing. Well, looks like there's only one thing I can do to win this race. Cheat! <laughs> I'm gonna make something to knock Blaze's boat right out of my way! I'll build... Oh, my! Those are some big waves! <laughs> that ought to stop Blaze! Whoa! Whoa! Where did all 
all these waves come from? <gasps> it's Crusher. He's making all these waves. Oh! It's working, Pickle. But I want these waves to be even bigger. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Crusher, I think you're making these waves a little too big. Darrington made the wood too heavy. Now the water is coming up over the sides. Huh? What's going on here? Darrington, you're sinking! Jump! Ta-da! Look at the wood Darrington is on now. Is it sinking or floating? Yeah! It's floating! Even with Darrington inside, the curved wood has those tall sides to keep the water out. <gasps> Here come the Grizzlies! Quick, everybody in! Woohoo! Yeah! Ha <laughs> ha! So long, Grizzlies! Does it float? <laughs> or sink? <laughs> Try it out! See what you think! It helps to be shaped kinda like a bowl Just shake and make sure it doesn't have a hole <laughs> A second? This must be the croaking cave frog's home. Where's the croaking cave frog? Yeah, there he is. We found him. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, I think the croaking cave frog wants us to play with him. <laughs> okay, little froggy, lead the way. There's an invisible way Doesn't sound good. The bridge! It's breaking behind us! If we're gonna make it across, we've gotta go faster. Quick! Let's check our speedometer. A speedometer is a tool that measures how fast a vehicle is moving. In a truck, the speedometer measures the speed your wheels are spinning. And the faster your wheels are spinning, the faster the speedometer says you're going. To make it to the other side, we need to go a speed of seven. Our speedometer says we're going this speed. What number is this? Seven, yeah! We've got the speed! <laughs> Just one more bridge to cross. Whoa! To get across this last bridge, we need to go our fastest speed yet, a speed of 10. The speedometer says we're going this speed. What number is this? Eight, yeah, that's not fast enough. Hang on, Blaze, I'll speed us up. Now what speed are we going? Just 
in time! And what comes last? Zoom! Yay! We did it! And look! There's the Sunstone! We're really close! <laughs> the Crusher is even closer! There's only one way we're gonna beat Crusher to that Sunstone. It's time to use Blazing Speed! To give me Blazing Speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! Let's get the Sunstone back to our friend, Rorian. Oh, poor Rorian. Oh, look! They're back! And they've got the Sunstone! Yeah. It's working! He's changing back! I missed you, my friends. And as for you, Blaze and AJ, my greatest thanks. You're welcome, Rorian. We're just happy that you're a real lion again. <laughs> Not just any lion. I'm a flying lion. <laughs> Come, friends, fly with me. is on the way! I wonder what's making that strange chomping sound. Chomp, 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 I don't know, but something tells me we're about to find out! I don't know, but something tells me we're about to find out! Pumpcaps! Oh man! The sharks are trying to chomp our boat! Well, we've got to find some way to get past them! We've got a delivery to make. Hey, I've got an idea. To get past the sharks, let's use a wave. Waves move energy from one place to another. If we make a big splash, that energy will travel through the water and create an ocean wave that can carry the sharks away. That's a great idea. Come on, let's give it a try. Here comes a shark! <laughs> Help us send him away with a really big wave! Say, wave! Wave! Ah! It worked! Yeah! Monster machine! is headed for those sharp branches. If his rap hits the branches, it'll pop and he'll sink. Tugboat to the rescue! Yeah! Woo! 
Push harder. Switching to visor view. Right now, Blaze is pushing with a force of five. But to stop the wrath, we need to push with a force of 15. Count to 15 with me. Start at five. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Amazing, Blaze! I've never seen anyone be a tugboat like that before! You totally saved me! Oh, you're welcome, Gasquatch. Now let's get you to that dock. <laughs> Uh-oh, those rocks are falling into the water and blocking the pipe. Now the water can't spin the turbine. It stopped making energy. No energy? This is terrible. Hmm, we need a vehicle that can go underwater and move those rocks away from the pipe. Hey, I know. What if we had an underwater excavator? An underwater excavator can drive under the water and scoop up heavy things. Yeah. Let's make the parts and turn me into an underwater excavator. Monster machine! Wow. Incredible! Now let's get scooping. There it is, please. The block pipe. Looks like there are nine rocks blocking the water from going through. Help me scoop all nine of them out of the way. Count down with me. Start at nine. Nine! Eight! Seven! seven six! Five! Four! four three! Through the pipe again. Now it can spin the turbine and turn the water power into energy. All right, time to put some of that energy into my battery. Wahoo! It's got energy! Yeah! That's great, Darrington. Love nuts! They're taking Gabby's toolbox across the water. We're gonna need a really fast boat to catch up. Hmm, those waves make it hard to go fast. When they knock into the boat, it causes friction and slows you down. Yeah, we want less friction so our boat can slide really fast across the water. So let's build a special boat that rides over the waves. A hydrofoil. I love it. Come on, let's make some parts and turn me into a hydrofoil. First, I need a hull so that I can float on the water. To make one, say, hull. Hull. Perfect. Now I need a propeller to spin really fast and push our boat forward. Say, propeller. Propeller. And most important of all, I've got to have foils to lift up over the waves. Shout, foils. Foils! All right, I'm ready to be a hydrofoil monster machine! Whoa! Blaze, you look awesome! Hang on, AJ. This hydrofoil is ready for action. What's that sound? Huh, well, it could be a fish, or or a whale. <gasps> or maybe it's a fish! Did I say that already? It's Blaze! 
Bumpy waves can slow him down, huh? It's nothing but smooth sailing for this sailboat. <laughs> Look out! A crocodile! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Uh-oh! The crocodile is catching up! The crocodile is moving at a speed of five kilometers an hour. And I'm going three kilometers an hour. Who's going faster? The crocodile, because five is more than three. Ha ha ha! We need more propulsion so we can go faster. Quick, let's raise another sail. Check it out. My speed went up to seven kilometers an hour. Now who's going faster? Me! Yeah! Speeding up! He's swimming as fast as he can! Now the crocodile is going eight kilometers an hour, and I'm going seven. Who's going faster? The crocodile! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! We need more propulsion to go even faster. Another sail coming right up. Check it out! My speed went up to 10 kilometers an hour. Who's going faster now? I am! In a while, crocodile! <laughs> Ice Blaster Bay. Such a strange name. I mean, why would anyone call a place something like that unless... Darrington! Look out! Oh, no! Poor Darrington! Please! Help! We've got to save him! There's a whole wall of ice blocking the way forward! We need a way to smash through all that ice. And I know a boat that has a lot of momentum, perfect for breaking up ice. An icebreaker ship! Yeah! Icebreaker ships are big and heavy. And the faster they go, the more momentum they have to break through the ice. Come on, help transform me into an icebreaker ship. First, I need a hull. That's the part of the ship that floats in the water. To make the hull, say, hull. Hull! Now I need a steel bow, so the front of the ship is super heavy. To make the steel bow, Say, steel bow. Steel bow! Last, I need propellers. They make the ship speed up so it has more momentum. To make the propellers, say, propellers. Propellers! Oh, yeah! I'm an icebreaker ship monster machine! Now let's go save Darrington with our momentum! Blaze can't win the race if he's trapped inside a trapper fish! <laughs> Watch out! That was close! Oh man! There are so many trapper fish! What do we do, Blaze? That was close! Oh man, there are so many trapper fish! What do we do, Blaze? Hmm, we need some way to get past them. And I've got an idea. What if we float the trapper fish away? Yeah! When you put something in the water, it either sinks down or floats up. And we know something that always floats up in the water, air! If something gets filled up with enough air, it'll float up in the water. Then, if a trapper fish traps it, it'll make the trapper fish float away too. 
Hey, I bet something in this old shipwreck floats. Look, I found a balloon and a rock. Which do you think will float, the balloon or the rock? Okay, let's test them and see. The balloon is floating, yeah! That's because it's full of air. Quick, here comes the trapper fish. Let's give him the balloon. Oh, right, it worked. He's floating away. Oh, man! But this big wall of ice is blocking the way! To smash through it, we've got to speed up to get more momentum. Help me accelerate to a speed of five. Count to five. One, One two, two, three, four, five! Momentum! Yeah. Caps, another ice wall. And it's even bigger than the last one. Then we're gonna need even more momentum. Help me accelerate to a speed of six. Count to six. One, one two, two, three, three four, four, five, six. Momentum! Yeah! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look! We've almost caught up with Darrington. Uh-oh, but there's one last ice wall, and it's the biggest one yet. To break it, we need the most momentum yet. A momentum of seven. Count to seven with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, we just have to get across the water to that dock over there. Boom! We can all ride there on this raft. That's a great idea. Yep, this raft is perfect, all right. It's big, it floats, it's right next to that bush full of truck berries. Truck berries? That's not good. Truck berries make <laughs> Gasquatch <laughs> sneeze! <laughs> <laughs> Hubcaps, he just sneezed the raft away. And he's not stopping. <laughs> that raft is really heavy. And heavy things are hard to stop when they're moving. That's inertia. We need to engineer something to help him. We need a tugboat. Tugboats are powerful boats that push heavy things on the water. A tugboat can push hard enough to stop Gaswatch's raft. Quick. Let's turn me into a tugboat. The first part we need is a hull. That lets the boat float on the water. To build a hull, say hull. Hull! Awesome! Now we need fenders to protect the hull when we're pushing. To build the fenders, say fenders. Fenders! At last, we need a propeller that spins fast and makes our tugboat push really hard. To make the propeller, say, propeller! Propeller! All right! I'm a tugboat monster machine! Look! See that rock in the water? It's shaped like a ramp. Yeah! If we drive our thunderboat fast enough off a ramp, we can jump over the pirate ships. Come on, let's go for it. Activating speedometer view. To jump over the red pirate ship, 
We need to go a speed of 30. Let's count by tens to 30. Repeat after me. 10, 10, 20, 20, 30, 30. And his ship is even bigger! Whoa! To jump over the yellow pirate ship, we need to be going a speed of 40! Let's count by tens to 40! Repeat after me! 10! 10! 20! 20! 30! 30! 40! 40! Nice one, Thunderbolt Blaze! Now there's just one pirate left! The Blue Pirate! And he's got the biggest ship of all! Yarr! You'll never get past the likes of me! Whoa. To jump over the Blue Pirate ship, we need to go our fastest speed yet! A speed of 60! Repeat after me! 10! 10! 20! 20! 30, 30, 40, 40, 50, 50, 50 60, 60! Oh, ho ho, ready! Yarg! Help us send them away with a really big wave. Say, wave. Wave! Ah! You won! Yeah! Jump, jump, jump! Look out, Blaze! Jump! Yeah. jump. Oh, we're sharks! Help us make an even bigger wave this time. Say, wave! But to get there, we'll have to get past the most sharks yet. Help us make a really, really big wave. Shout, wave! Special delivery, pirate! Shiver me timbers! Ha <laughs> <laughs> Now I can finally open me treasure chest! So, what is it, pirate? Yeah, what's inside? The treasure be... Pirate snacks! <laughs> 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 Everyone, it's fan boat time! Woo Gorm Gormy! Look! Gormy's finding things in the swamp he's never seen before! Like birds! Oh. And lily pads! Gormy Gorm Gorm! And that alligator! <laughs> Look out, Blaze! Whew, that was close! For me! We'd better be careful. There might be more alligators where that came from. Help us keep a lookout. If you see any more alligators, say alligator. Alligator! <laughs> Come 
Come on, we better keep looking. If you see another alligator, say alligator. Alligator! Chop, chop! Woo! Yeah. You're right, Gormy. We're almost at the battery. But to get there, it sounds like we'll have to make it past one more alligator. When you see the last alligator, say alligator. Alligator! Let's create a machine that can help us. Yeah, we can use mechanical engineering. Mechanical engineering is when you design a new machine to solve a problem. To solve our blaster fish problem, we need to design a machine that can go fast across the water, like a speedboat. But we also need to break apart those cannonballs. So let's give our machine something really strong, like a jackhammer. Check it out. We just designed the world's first Monster Machine Jackhammer Speedboat! Blasterfish just blasted two cannonballs. And here comes one more. How many cannonballs are there all together? Three, right. One, two, three. Get ready, Blaze. Two cannonballs headed this way. And here come two more! How many are there all together? Four! Yeah! One! Two! Three! Four! Oh, oh yeah! We almost made it across the ocean! But that blaster fish isn't giving up! It just blasted one cannonball! And four more! How many cannonballs are there all together? Five! Right! One, two, three, four, five! Balloon's taking Darrington out over the water. To catch up, we'll need something that can take us across the water fast. Hey, I know what we need. A hydroplane speedboat. It's really light and has two powerful engines, so it can zoom on top of the water super fast. Come on, let's build one. First, let's make the planing hull. It's really light so our boat can glide on the top of the water. To make the planing hull, say, planing hull. Planing hull! Now let's build the propeller. When the propeller spins, it pushes the boat forward. To make the propeller, say, propeller. Propeller! Last, we need two powerful engines, so our boat goes really fast. To make the engines, say, engines. Engines! Oh, yeah! I'm a hydroplane speedboat monster machine! You're right, Stunt Kitty. There's Darrington. Hmm, that balloon is flying really high. We've got to find some way to get up there so we can save him. I think Stunt Kitty has an idea. Whoa! Ooh. Stunt Kitty's using a parachute like a kite to fly up into the air. Yeah, she's parasailing. Stunt Kitty, you're here! Oh, thank goodness! 
Kitty's trying to save Darrington, but she's not flying high enough to reach him. Whoa! Uh oh, the bridge is gone. Hop in, hop caps. How are we gonna catch that train now? Hey, I've got an idea. Look, we can use that raft to cross the water. Yeah, let's give it a whirl. Nothing to stop us now, except maybe alligators! Alligators? Whoa! Look out! Gaskets! I've never seen alligators like these before. They're so shiny and golden. That's because these aren't regular old gators. They're gold gators. Whoa! Look out! way to get rid of a gold gator is to give him a piece of gold. But where are we going to find gold at a time like this? Hey, I know. We could find gold right here in the river. Yeah, we just need a gold dredge. A gold dredge is a machine that digs up stuff from the bottom of the water to help us find pieces of gold. Come on, let's build one. First, we need a strong motor to give our gold dredge power. To make the motor, say, motor. Motor! Now let's make the boom arm. It's the part that reaches down to the bottom of the water. To make the boom arm, say, boom arm. Boom arm! Last, we need the bucket line. The bucket line scoops things up so we can find gold. To make the bucket line, say, Bucket line! Bucket line! Oh, yeah! I'm a gold dredge monster machine! Yeah! Huh, I wonder where the next emergency could be. Look, over there! Gaskets, that lighthouse is on fire! But how are we gonna get there? The lighthouse is on an island way out in the water! To save the lighthouse, we need a special firefighting vehicle that's made to go on the water. We need a fireboat. Yeah. A fireboat uses a pump to pull in water from below the boat. Then it sends the water blasting out of a big water cannon to put out fires. Come on, help build the parts to turn me into a fireboat. First, I need the hull so our fireboat can float on the water. To make the hull, say, hull. Hull! Great! Now, we just need a water cannon to blast out the water from our pump. To make the water cannon, say, water cannon. Water cannon! Oh, right! I'm a fireboat monster machine! Activating fireboat pump! It's working! Our pump is moving water from the ocean to the water cannon. Help us aim so we're spraying water right onto those flames. To hit the flames, should we aim to the left or the right? To the left, yeah! me blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! We got 
Flippy back home to his family. <laughs> and just look how happy they are to be together again. <laughs> What's he saying, Blaze? I think Flippy and his family are going for a swim, and he wants us to come too. You got it, Flippy. Big, big, big roll! A second? I think I know how we can sail our boat past him. Look! Every time an eel pops up, there's always three bubbles. It's zapping time! <laughs> ah! Oh! Oh man, if we're gonna keep away from those eels, we need to look out for three bubbles. Oh! I see bubbles! Is that three bubbles? No, that's only two. Ha! It's just a little turtle. Look, more bubbles over there. Is that three bubbles? Yeah! Coming at you! Is that three bubbles? Yes! Get ready for a shot! Whee! <laughs> yeah! We got past another eel! Damn! <laughs> We're almost at the first piece of the key! But we'd better keep a lookout. There could still be more eels out there somewhere. Is that three bubbles? Nope, that's four. <laughs> Hello, crab! Is that three bubbles? Yeah! That's it! <laughs> Hang on! Don't worry, whales. We're gonna find your baby and bring her home safe. Lifeguards to the rescue! Listen, that sounds like the baby whale. She must be inside that cave. Uh-oh, be careful, Blaze. Those sound like... something jellyfish! Whoa! Careful! More jellyfish up ahead! To get past these jellyfish, should we sink down or float up? Sink down! Right! Adding water to sink down! get to her, we'll have to get past these last jellyfish. How should we steer our submarine? Sink down or float up? Float up! We did it! We found the baby whale! <laughs> Come on, 
on, little whale. Let's get you back to your family. Now follow me. Animals, AJ and I are gonna get that crown back. Shark power! Go get them, shark plays! need to find things that don't have a lot of density. Density is all about the particles inside of things. When something has lots of heavy particles inside, it has more density. But when something has fewer, lighter particles, it has less density. Things that have more density tend to sink. And things that are less dense tend to float. Here, maybe one of these can float the chomper fish away. We've got beach balls and bowling balls. Beach balls have a density of two. And bowling balls have a density of eight. Which number is less, two or eight? Two, right. That means beach balls have less density. Load the beach balls. Beach balls away. Chopper fish is floating away! Come on! These chopper fish can't stop us, cause we know about density! Stunt Kitty's parachute goes higher. Is Stunt Kitty flying as high as Darrington? No, not yet. She still needs to go higher. Whoa! Stunt Kitty! To make Stunt Kitty fly higher, let's speed up even more. Say acceleration. Acceleration! is making Stunt Kitty's parachute fly higher. Now is she flying as high as Darrington? No, she needs to go a little higher. Hey, look, a storm cloud up ahead. A storm cloud? Yay! Stunt Kitty, help! Look out, Quick, to save Darrington, We've got to speed up to go even faster. Shout acceleration! 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 Now is Stunt Kitty flying as high as Darrington? Yeah! Whoa! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stunt Kitty! Kitty, you're the brave! 
bravest kitty cat in the whole wide world. Meow, meow, meow. Now hang on, everyone. We've got a show to finish. Yeah! <laughs> Help us look for him. Where do you see a fish? Right there, hiding in the seaweed. Yeah! <laughs> okay, fishy. Ready to brush those teeth? Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> there, all done. <laughs> Listen, sounds like there's another fish hiding over there. Let's look. Where do you see the fish? Behind that rock! <laughs> All right, little fish, let's see those teeth. <laughs> now your teeth are shiny and clean. <laughs> Good work, Blaze. Just one more fish to go. <laughs> and it sounds like he's over this way. Where do you see the fish? Up there, yeah! Okay, little fish, say ah! There, all finished! Now come on, little fishies. Let's show Dentist Brody your nice, clean teeth. They're back! Wow! Look at all those clean teeth! You fish have all earned stickers! <laughs> oh. Hurry, y'all! There's a gold gator coming up fast! Chop, 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 gold! Quick, let's look for a piece of gold that we can give him! Activating gold trash! Now look carefully. When you see a piece of gold, Say, gold. Gold! We found some! Hey, Gator! Look at what we found! It worked! <laughs> that Gator loves the gold so much, he's swimming away. Uh-oh! Here comes another gold Gator! Come on, we've got to hurry and find more gold. Look carefully. When you see a piece of gold, say gold. Gold! Here, Gator, catch! Chop, chop. <laughs> yeah! He's swimming away! Good news, fellas. We're almost at the other side of the river. Chop, chop, chop. Yeah. But to get there, we've got to find gold to give this last gator. When you see a piece of gold, say gold. Gold! 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 Yeah! Gold! Gold! gold. <laughs> water on those flames over there. Activating fireboat pump. <laughs> to hit these flames, should we aim the water higher or lower? Lower, yeah! Just one more set of flames to go. Activating fireboat pump. To put out these last flames, should we aim higher or lower? Higher! Saving the lighthouse 
this was our second emergency. How many emergencies are left? One, yeah! Firefighters to the rescue! I can't wait to use our key and see what's inside! <laughs> Whoa! What's going on, Blaze? Gaskets! There's a whirlpool dead ahead! Oh boy! It's taking things to the bottom of the sea! Like that rock! And that shell! And that treasure chest! Treasure chest? Oh no! We've got to hurry before it goes to the bottom of the sea! Hang on, crew! It's time to sail this ship with blazing speed! <laughs> to give us blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! Okay, crew, this is it. Time to put the key in and see what's inside. <laughs> this is so exciting! Whoa! It's a Ferris wheel! And a water slide! And a roller coaster! Whoa! Nothing can hide from a shark. Check it out. Whenever an animal moves in the water, they make tiny waves called vibrations. And sharks have super special sensors on their body that can feel those vibrations. So even if we can't see a Hyderbot, we can still figure out where it's hiding by feeling the vibrations. Come on, let's use our sensors to help us get past those horrible Hyderbots. Hang on, I'm feeling a vibration. That means there must be a Hyderbot hiding somewhere right nearby. Let's look for him. Where's the Hyderbot hiding? Right there! <laughs> Not so fast, horrible Hyderbot. Oh, right! We trapped him! That Hyderbot can't get us now. Hmm. There's gotta be something around here that can get us moving. Hey, what about the wind? That could give us propulsion. The wind, yeah! Wind helps to move vehicles, like sailboats. It pushes on the sail and creates a force that makes the sailboat move. Come on then, let's turn me into a sailboat. First, I'll need a catamaran hull so I can float on water. To make the catamaran hull, say, catamaran hull. Catamaran hull! Next, I need a tall mast. That's the part that holds the sail. To make the mast, say, mast. Mast! Now for the most important part. I need a sail to catch the wind and give us propulsion. To make the sail, say, sail. Sail! Yeah! I'm a sailboat monster machine! Woohoo! Time for some wind propulsion! Oh, yeah! yeah! Oh, when I get that engine, I will be so fast! I'll come in first place, and Blaze will be last! Hey, Crusher! Ah! Great news! I just built you an even faster! 
Master Engine than last time. It's the Pepperoni Pizza Engine! Pepperoni Pizza Engine? I'm a bumper car monster machine! Now, let's go catch those bubble blasters. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Check it out! Blaze is a bumper car! <laughs> nice bouncing, bro! Blaze, look! A bubble blaster just went around that corner! Let's figure out where to bounce so we can grab it! Switching to visor view. This is us over here, and that's the bubble blaster over there. Visor, show us where we can bounce. If we bounce off the blue mailbox, we'll go all the way over there. Uh-oh. That won't get us to the bubble blaster. That's too big of an angle. But if we bounce off the green mailbox, it'll make a much smaller angle. Will that lead us to the bubble blaster? Yeah, it'll take us right to it. Let's bounce! Whoa! Gotcha! Nice one, Blaze. Look, the second bubble blaster went over there. Quick, let's figure out where to bounce so we can grab it. Take a look. If we bounce off the purple crate, we'll go at a big angle like this. And if we bounce off the red crate, we'll go at a smaller angle like this. Which crate should we bounce off to get to the bubble blaster? The purple crate. Yeah! Whoa! All right! We caught the second bubble blaster. Only one more to catch. And it turned onto that street over there. If we bounce off the blue dumpster, we'll go at a small angle. If we bounce off the green dumpster, we'll go at a bigger angle. And if we bounce off the red dumpster, we'll go at a really big angle. Which dumpster should we bounce off to get the bubble blaster? The green one, right! <laughs> Yes! We did it, Blaze! We got all three bubble blasters! Uh-oh! <laughs> Zeg! Are you all right, buddy? Oh, machine blast Zeg with big berries! Oh, man! How are we gonna get past these berry blasters? Hey, I see a way! We can use these rolling pins to make big collisions and bash the berries away. Come on, Zeg. Grab a rolling pin and follow me. All right! Blaze bash berries! Be careful, everyone. Sometimes a berry blaster pops out on my side, and sometimes it's on Zeg's side. Oh, Berry Blaster! Who's it gonna blast? Blaze or Zeg? Blaze! Yeah! Bash him, Blaze! Yeah. Yeah. Hooray! Nice going, Blaze! Another Berry Blaster! Who's it gonna blast? Blaze or Zeg? Zay! Look out, Zay! <laughs> Berries go poof! Nice one, Zay! Berry Blaster! Who's it gonna hit? Blaze or Zay? Zay! Alright! Look! There's the way out! Uh-oh! Two berry blasters! Who are they gonna blast? Blaze and Zay! Hooray! Yippee! We made it past the berry blasters! Go 
goes in two different directions. They wonder which way we go. To get out of this cave, we've got to take the bridge that keeps going. Which one keeps going? The blue bridge or the red bridge? The blue bridge, yes! Uh-oh, bridge spin again! Which way keeps going? The yellow bridge or the green bridge? The green bridge, yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> Hang on, babies! We almost out of cave! Just one last split! Which way keeps going? The purple bridge, the orange bridge, or the yellow bridge? The orange bridge! Right! <laughs> this way to T-Rex Rock! Robot Power! Zig have to get out of bubble. Zig smash bubble. Zig! Uh-oh! Zig! Oh no! He's rolling away in a giant snowball! Don't worry, guys. We'll catch him. Whoa! Zig can't stop rolling! Whoa, 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 whoa. We're coming, Zig! I need your help to steer me so I can follow him. Help me steer Blaze. Put your hands up and grab the steering wheel. That's it. Grab the steering wheel. Yeah. Turn the steering wheel to follow Zed. Whoa. Turn the steering wheel left. Turn. Yeah, great driving. Whoa, Zeg's still rolling. Turn Blaze to the right! Turn right! <laughs> Keep helping me steer Blaze! Whoa! Turn Blaze to the left! Turn the steering wheel! Whoa! Whoa! Turn Blaze to the right! Gaskets! Seg is headed right for that cliff! Whoa! This bad! We've got to go super fast and catch him! Quick, to give me blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! Oh, Zane's so happy! Blaze saves Zane! <laughs> You can ask your parents to subscribe to Nickelodeon's Blaze and the Monster Machines YouTube channel for new videos every week.